The road to the final promo is still live, and EA have released the upgrade packs that they usually do for Monday 6pm content. This time round it is going to be the 81 plus double upgrades, and in this video I will be showing you guys the most efficient ways to craft these upgrade packs in FIFA 23. So guys, if we go over to the SVC section here, and we do go to the live section, if you do scroll along, you will find the 81 plus double upgrade. Along with the 83 plus times 10 upgrade that did get released this 6pm content. But if we have a look at this 81 plus double, you will see that you will need all rare gold players and you're going to need 10. You're going to need to put all rare golds into this squad. They can either be gold or they could be Libertadores cards, which a lot of people do often forget about. But if we do put these cards in here, we will be able to craft one of these packs. Pretty simple here, you can put the quality to low to high if you do have a lot of gold in your club. There we go, there we go, that is one 81 plus double upgrade crafted. We can submit that straight away and that crafts one of them for us. If we yet again go back into this SBC, I will favourite it so it makes it easier for us to find. We can go into this and... To make this a more efficient way to craft these, we can put the position on any, go to quality and put it to Comnable Libertadores cards. If we put it to low to high and find any Libertadores cards that are 75 and up, as these cards do count for the gold rare cards. These cards will be on the market like usual, but as you can see, I have a lot of these cards in my club without even realising. A lot of 75 rated ones. If we just put all of these in and as you can see there are tons and tons more that I have that I could probably craft around five more with the amount of cards that I have in my club but as you can see these cards do count so we can submit this just like the gold rare cards and this would count towards crafting yet again another 81 plus double but without further ado let me show you an efficient method to be able to make coins to craft these packs so guys, if you guys do want to go and head over to the store section, if you do go to the bronze packs, if you go to browse and then go down to classic packs, you will see there is a premium bon bronze pack for 750 coins. What you want to gonna do is just carry on opening these until you get enough cards in your club that you can put these into bronze upgrades, into silver upgrades and then into gold upgrades to get the gold rares. If you can check each player in this club to see if they are selling for anything. This card is going to be selling for around 300 coins, so we could sell that if we needed to. But you can just check any of the players in these cards, any of these players in this pack to check their price. This guy looked like he, no, only 200 coins. But then you can go ahead and quick sell all of these to gain the coins that, there you go. It's only 200 coins, but that does mean we only have to spend 500 coins on the next pack. We can send all of these to club. And then we can just keep repeating this method as many times as you want until you're happy with how many cards you have in your club. Just skip it because you're not really going to get anyone good. But you can just check the price of the cards. If they're not going for anything, don't sell them. Like this guy, he could be selling for a little bit. There we go. He's selling for 500 coins. We can put him up for 450 coins there. Meaning we do almost gain back all the coins that we spent on this pack. This French goalkeeper here might be going for a little bit. There we go, around 800 coins. We can sell, put him up for 700 coins to a quick buyer. And then you just want to quick sell the rest of these items in the pack. And yet again, send them to club. As you can see, this method is does cost quite a few coins. But then you can go over to the SBC section. Go to upgrades. All the way to bronze upgrade. And then you can put these players... You can just use a squad builder if you want to, but you can put it low to high and then just put the quality to bronze. This will auto complete the squad full of just bronze players in your club. You can submit this and then you do get a two silver players pack. What you want to gonna do is head over to the store section, open this pack, and then keep repeating this method until you have enough silver players to be able to put into the silver upgrade to get the gold commons. There's not going to be anyone in this pack, so we can just skip it. And they are going to be untradeable, so we're just going to want to send them straight to the club. And then we can go back over to the SVC section here. I don't have many silvers in my club at the moment due to me using this method. 
but we can then put this low to high, put it on silver, and there you go. It does auto complete the squad for us. We'll just fill this in with just some random silver players that I do have left in my club. And then that does get us a three common gold players pack that yet again, head over to the store, open this pack, keep repeating until you have enough gold commons to be able to put into the gold upgrade. And then that gold upgrade will get you two rare gold player pack. And then once you've done this method enough, you will have the 10 gold rares to be able to put into the 81 plus double. So yet again, Heading over to the SBCs, upgrades, and then we go to the gold upgrade. And then we then you can just use the squad builder like I've used in the past two SBCs. Put it on gold, low to high. And then it will auto fill the squad with just gold commons that you have in your club. Make sure to take out any gold res because you can use them for the 81 plus double. We can submit this and yet again, pretty repetitive process. Head over to the store. And then we can open this gold pack. Two rare gold players pack. This will get us two rare golds that we can then put into the 81 plus doubles. They are both going to be duplicates in this scenario. But we can do that. And then we can head out of this. It was Hoffman and a Libertadores card. Head over to the SVC section. Go into the 81 plus double. Start from scratch. And then fill in the squad with any players that do meet the requirements so it's going to be Hoffman and Barboza and then we can just set this to Libertadores and fill the rest in oh we're going to want to set it to low to high 75 pluses there we go fill all of this in pretty straightforward process here guys fill all of it in until all the players are in and there we go, we can submit this and yet again another 81 plus double completed. If you keep using this bronze pack method, you can craft as many of these as you want. You will need a few coins, but you will end up packing some bronze players that you will be able to sell on for thousands and thousands of coins. So without further ado, let's move on to the second method to be able to make coins to craft the 81 plus double upgrades. So guys, another way you can gain these gold rare cards to be able to complete that 81 plus double upgrade is by going over to the icon section. And if you click on any of these icons, you will be able to see there is a bronze that you just put in 11 bronze rares and a silver where you put in 11 silver rares. And these two do get you back a two red gold players pack for each one. And there are many different icon SPCs that you can do this for. So for every icon, you will be able to get four gold rares. They are going to be tradable. So if you do end up packing anyone, you can then sell them to make some coins. If we just put in the bronze rare here, low to high yet again, put it the position on any. And then we can just quickly fill all of this in with the bronze rares that you do have in your club. I don't have many at the moment, but yet again, I'm pretty sure you can use the Libertadores cards under 64 rated. And they will count as the bronze rares. Libertadores, low to high. We do have one here. But if we quickly head over to the transfer market and buy another one of these bronze rares very quickly. As they are only 200 coins. We can quickly... We'll just buy one here. Let's see if we can just. We'll just scroll down. Hopefully, get one. There we go. Whack him straight into the squad. And that is another two rare gold players pack that you can head over to the store. This is going to be a tradable pack. So, like I was saying, if you do get anyone, then you can sell them for coins and then obviously put them back into the packs. <clears throat> Excuse me. If we open this, it isn't going to be anything, but we do yet again get two gold rares that we can put back into the upgrade packs. So if you head over to the SVCs, you will see that there's a silver one. I don't have many silver players in my club, but we'll check how many we have. Likewise with the other one, you can just put the same silver rare, low to high, chuck any of these in that you don't care about losing. Some of these cards may go for a lot, but all of these cards are untradeable for me, so we'll just put all of these cards in. And there we go. We just have enough to be able to complete this SBC. 
There we go, another two rare gold players pack, meaning we have got four rare gold cards just from that two squads that we have submitted. Isn't going to be anything yet again, but if you do have some good luck, you might be able to pack one of the cards. We, this one is a duplicate, so we'll just send them up to transfer list. But if you do this for all the icon cards, you will be able to craft a couple of the 81 plus gold rare upgrades. So let's move on to the third way of crafting these packs. So guys, the last method to make coins to craft the 81 plus double upgrades is going to be, likewise shown in the previous video, the gold common and Premier League mass bidding strategy. You're going to want to put the max price to 350 or 400 coins and bid on any of these cards for below 400 coins or 400 coins. If you bid on them, you will get outbidded on a lot of these cards, but if you bid on them enough, you will be able to gain a few, and then you can sell all of these cards on for around 500 coins, as Premier League is a top 5 league, meaning the cards are in high demand. There we go, we have bidded on a few here, and we can head over to the transfer targets. We have been outbidded on a lot of, lot of these, but... We can just go back over, we're not going to win any of them, but we'll go back over to the transfer market, do this all again, put, the, put this on for 400 coins, scroll over a few pages, 350, bid on that, bid on all of these, and then hopefully you will end up winning a few of these. Just do exactly what's happening on screen guys, and then you will be able to make some coins. You can sell all of them on for at least 500 coins, depending on how much they are worth when you guys are doing this method. A lot of these will, yet again, get outbidded, but if you do this enough, you will gain a few cards, and then you can sell these on for high profits. So, we'll head over to the store now to see if we can pack any one good out of the 81 plus doubles. We do have five here that I have crafted over this episode. It's going to be an inform and it's going to be Spanish right mid. It's going to be a nice 87 rated team of the week Canales. That is some very good fodder there that we can put into an SBC and an Arnautovic in there. Very good pack to start off the, these five. Moving on to the second here guys. Hopefully we can top that second one. It's going to be a board Spanish right wing. Marco Asensio, nothing special there. 83 rated board. They're both going to be duplicates, and I think we're going to have to quick sell them. Yeah, we are. But if you guys did want to recycle them back into the 81 plus double upgrades, then you could. But just for the sake of this video, I will just be quick selling them. Isn't going to be a board here, so we will just skip this. Argentinian centre mid. That one is going to be Lo Celso. Quick sell that card there. Yeah, again, could recycle that, but it's fine. We've got two left now. Best card that we've pulled is going to be a Team of the Week walkout. It's in Portuguese left back, and that is going to be Rafael Guerrero. That is yet again a very nice Team of the Week pull. That is two Team of the Weeks that we have managed to pull now. And a Dani Olmo in there. We can send them to club, and that is some very nice fodder out of these 81 plus doubles. The last one now, see if we can top any of these packs. Isn't going to be a board, but them five were very successful. Two informed walkouts. I would say that is a big W. So if you guys did enjoy this video and it did help, don't forget to like, subscribe, turn on notifications so you never miss an upload. But we'll see you in the next video. Peace.